was talking to myself. I hate when notifications come up. You know, I, I run a, a Facebook page called That Good, dedicated to good eats and, and uh, restaurants and nutrition. I also have uh, The Wild West, and I have also my personal Facebook page and Instagram and this YouTube channel for The Awake. And I put together videos of hard-hitting truth, and sometimes I do say words, you know. You know what I'm saying? I say words because I get annoyed, all right? But the message I'm giving out is uh, telling you the truth. And some people, a lot of people can't handle it, especially on fake, uh, fake book, where fake friends uh, get offended and delete you over every little thing. If you come into the For the Awake channel, you're here for a reason, because you like the content, and uh, that's why you're here, for the content, and you, you agree with it. Pretty much for the most part, you know that there are chemtrails. The 5G death towers are bad. Uh, EMF radiation is uh, causes a C word that rhymes with answer. And you know that there's um, anti God, anti Christian uh, uh, people out there, including in the form of fake news. And they're pro abortion and they're pro Antifa and pro everything that's not good. So that's why I make videos, shed light on it in the truth community. You know, I'm dealing with low budget technology, it's a struggle. But, you know, I think between the shadow banning and the fact that people just don't care to sheeple, it's very hard to wake them up. And because I think because of the aluminum and from the chemtrails has affected them, a lot of them, to the point they don't know what a cloud looks like. They start saying that EMF radiation is good for you, there's no harm, no proof. And it's, it's like, I can't wake them up, sheeple. I'm trying, but between the shadow banning and the fact that I'm dealing with, I treat them, if you've got uh, Alzheimer's, you, you, you're a patient then. So I have to treat them as patients. And talk to mentally ill patients that don't that, that are affected from, from aluminum in their brain. That's the only thing I could think of why people come at me and say those are contrails and radiation from EMF is perfectly fine. And radiation in general, you emitted from all these devices. you got to be something wrong with you. So I'm like, you know what, This I'm taking time off. I've said what I had to say, either you're, either you're awake by now or you are far gone. And most are, sadly, far gone. With that said, I uh, hope you enjoy the... Uh, this what could be the final edition of the shock treatment for quite some time. I don't know. I'm going to take time off. Unless something, uh, uh, you know, catches my eye like this one. Stay tuned for shock treatment. But it might be the last one. I don't know. Well, it could be the last one for a while. We'll see. Stay tuned for shock treatment. And start something he did. And Chris Cuomo responded. Take a look at this video and then we'll break it down. Separating the truth from the lies. Coming at you from underneath the Noonan, Georgia, heavily chemtrailed sky. You're about to receive dose. One of the last ones for now of the shock treatment. Let's go out with a bang, you know, before I take a break from all this. I don't know how it's going to come out on your end. I mean, I've, I've tried to um, record this using the same exact uh, resolution that the, the video is. So we'll see how it comes out. If not, I think you know the deal of what's going on and you could uh, always expand it on your laptop or computer um, or watch it on your cell phone which is where you're going to see it perfectly formatted tomatoes tomorrow whatever whatever uh, but this one I just couldn't help resist I just I, I wasn't going to do one today but when I see this crap it just pisses me off because Chris Como, 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 Como you know what that rhymes with right that's exactly what you're acting like you're acting like a biatch because someone called him Fredo. I never even heard of Fredo. I've seen Godfather, but uh, who, who remembers uh, 40 years ago, or 30 years ago when I seen it? 
So he's called Afredo, and he wants to uh, act out and act unprofessional, caught on film. Let me, let me, why isn't the uh, CNN or whoever he works for, one of those commie news network, I think it's the commie news network, why aren't they um, reprimanding him? Is that how we're, uh, CNN, that's how you like being represented? Of course they do. CNN and Microsoft, the S, uh, LSD and the commie news network and the rest of these satanic communist George Soros backed New World Order, Luciferian globalist. They're not news, they're the arm of the New World Order. That's how they roll. They like the, the violence. They like to put out the violence, don't they? And guess what, you idiot, tough guy, uh, pseudo tough guy, Cuomo. You make Italians look bad. I'm an Italian. Uh, if someone called me afraid, I'll be like, what's that? And if they say, well, dumbass, yeah, that'll piss me off. And I would say some words back, of course, you know, but if I was a professional, like, say, for instance, supposed to be a professional, well, you're professionally fake news, uh, representing CNN, of course, you wouldn't catch me dead doing that. I'm just saying, or whatever news organization I'm affiliated with, or whatever business, I certainly wouldn't be acting out like that. So this shouldn't be condoned. This should not be, uh, CNN should not be applauding and defending and standing by this so-called man. Um, he acted like someone that's just out of control. Whenever you look at him in his eyes, the eyes are the window to the soul, he looks like a commie. He looks like a Luciferian. He looks like an emotional nut job, just like the rest of them, just like the mad cow. And who's that other guy that, uh, I don't know, a black guy that said uh, destroy all the Trumpsters? And how about... Uh, the hunt that they finally uh, took down. I'm glad you pushed back, patriots and conservatives. That's what you need, Christians. Push back, everyone, because these people are pieces of crap. He's a Luciferian. He's a devil. Look at these eyes over here, man. That looks like the eyes of a sane man. Is this the actions of a sane man? No, it's not. It's one that's a lame man, no brain man, Chris Cuomo. Well, Hannity, maybe... Uh, yeah, okay, the guy is being a jackass, sure, but you don't get up and act like that, all right? Unless, you know, I, because this goes hand in hand in how uh, he, how these these people on the left, so to speak, these Luciferians, this is what they're about. They're about uh, violence, promoting violence, you, you know, uh, pro-abortion, anti-God, anti-America, uh, and this is this is all the, this, let me tell you something. I wouldn't be a bit surprised if he called this uh, uh, guy a Trump supporter, you know? And, and that's where all his hatred's coming from. He was called Fredo. Okay, he was called a Fredo. Well, I think that suits him quite well. I mean, he is a loser. Anybody that works for damn Commie News Network, you're a loser. And a loser, Luciferian. And Microsoft LSD. And if you work for Fox, Slate, Salon, ABC, NBC, CBS, and about the 90% of the rest that's owned by the globalists, all right? Because these people are always spewing violence, they're always spewing, and they're supporting Antifa, so of course, um, you know, they would endorse this behavior. Uh, Hannity's coming at it from a different angle. If the guy's out with his, his parents and stuff, I mean his parents, his kids and his wife, I don't know, I didn't see that in the video. It could be, it could be. But the thing is, if this was an isolated incident, I would say, you know, coming from that side, I would say, you know, this is, uh, this is, uh, I, I agree with him, but all I hear is violence. All we hear is violence and, and horrible fake news rhetoric against the president, against uh, anyone who voted for him. And so this behavior goes hand in hand with all the rhetoric, all the talk, all the hatred. Look at his eyes. He looks crazy to begin with. That's crazy, man. Just like Mad Cow. This guy looks uh, certified nuts. All right, so you support, of course you do. You always support uh, jackasses like that. Now, Hanny's coming at it from a different angle. I don't agree with it, but, you know, if he was out with his nine-year-old nine year daughter and his wife, the guy's being a jackass. All right, but, you know, how long was the guy being a jackass? How many times did he call him Afredo? And he is, he is a, a loser and, and a moron. He works for fake news, and that's all he spews is fake news. So uh, the shoe fits, you know, the jackass. You're going to be out in public, jackass, and you've been spewing a lot of hate. So, uh... uh Cuomo rhymes with you know what, so uh, and the rest of them. So uh, you know you, you you endorse Antifa doing this. You endorse you know all the jackasses attacking Trumpsters, right? But someone comes up to you and calls you afraid of, and the little snowflake gets mad. The little snowflake gets mad, right? And flies off the handle. Look at those eyes, man. Look at that crap. Let, let's rewind that. Look at that. Now where 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 he at? 
Uh, yeah, he's out of control. He looks out of control. Even on the set, he looks out of control. These eyes right here, look at that. That looks sane to you? Of course not. I can tell the eyes are the windows of the soul. This guy is a nut job, man. Just like the rest of them. Mad cow. Uh, Chris uh, threw up his leg because of Obama. And, and the rest of them. Kook Alberman. Uh, and the list goes on and on. You know, I don't even watch that crap because it's, it's satanic, the fake news. So Hannity, you know, I can understand where Hannity's come from, but I, I agree more with what uh, Trump said. I can already see it. I can, I can see how he is. I see how we, how they are on the set, what they say. Um, and so these are hostile people to begin with. I mean, hostile sheeple, I should say, to begin with. So this kind of behavior goes hand in hand. An example, what an embarrassment to the Commie News net- Network in a string of embarrassments for them, huh? Who, 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 is this guy a Russian plan? Fake news? Next thing you know, it'd be saying that, or saying that he's a Trump supporter. I'm just disgusted with the insanity, and also the, this Matrix thing that is constantly messing up on me. Constantly, man. Oh, that's enough now. That's, uh, that's all I want to see this jackass. Because that's what he is. He's a jackass, and he's a, he's a commie. That's the way these commies are. How do you like it, commie? Getting a taste of your own medicine? He called you a Fredo. He, he called you what you are, a, a loser. All right? So loser, so loser, shut the up, loser, all right? Because that's what you are. That's what the rest of them are, too, who uh, uh, spew the fake news, Russia, 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 Russia. Look at this guy, man. Some tough guy, huh? Real tough guy. Unbelievable, man. Unbelievable. Unbelievable, man. I, 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 I've had enough of this nonsense. Anyway, and then you had the other guy. Who was it? It was on fake news, MS, uh, uh, Microsoft LSD, saying destroy uh, all the... Uh, uh, patriots, the ones that vote for Trump. You know, I don't. I, I, I was going to back off politics a little bit, but th- this is, goes above politics. This is just uh, pure wickedness, these people. You know? It's nuts. Well, that's it. I mean, I'm going to be taking some time off for now. I mean, this, ain't, this is going to fall upon deaf ears anyway, because uh, shadow banning, the, the people, the lack of... The shadow banning, the lack of, uh, you know... <laughs> people, you know, it's shadow banning and... The fact that people don't care. They might care about this, because this, this is more like politics sort of thing, or fake news, policy sort of thing, and it's a person acting out. But overall, uh, overall, they, they don't care. They don't care. I'm having a lot of technical issues, as always. But they don't, they don't care. So, you know what? They don't care. I said what I had to say about the chemtrails. I said what I had to say about the 5G. I've said what I had to say so far about many things, all right? And either it reaches them, either... They're either they're awake and they're on board or they're not. And fighting over, like one person did, fighting and saying EMF is no test, or no scientist proof that it causes the C word to rhyme the answer. I mean, these people, are, that's, I'm going to treat them like that the aluminum in the chemtrails has affected their brain. And and so it's, uh, it's affected their brain for them to say that the uh, uh, EMF or anything else, there's no such thing as chemtrails and EMF is uh, okay. So because... The, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to chalk it up as the aluminum in the chemtrails and the vaccines that they're taking and it's affected them so much that I have to treat them like with kids gloves like mental patients because it's not normal we got a lot of people that are not normal we're trying to wake them up but they're so far pro- they're so programmed so far gone look at this nut so far gone that I don't know if it's even possible so I'm going to quit spinning my wheels for a while and I'm going to take time off alright that's it I'm going to focus on my YouTube channel my that good food page, and that's it. And the Wild West is going to go off for a while. Going to uh, take a break. And also the shock treatment. All right? I don't know which is more of a shock to you, if it is at all. The fact that Chris Cuomo rhymes with, uh, uh, you know, portrayed exactly what they all are on that side. Nut jobs. Or <laughs> uh, the fact that I'm not going to do this for a while. I don't know. It doesn't matter anyway. And Hannity, I would, you're a nice guy. I wouldn't even def, I wouldn't even come to his defense because these son of a bitches never come to yours or anyone else's conservative Christians or anything like that, a patriot. So I wouldn't, I wouldn't have. But that just shows you the, uh, the, the caliber of, of, of his personality, of who he is, um, the contents of it, of Sean Hannity. He'll even uh, be fair and go and, and defend someone that he believes should be defended, even though these people hate uh conservatives they hate christians they hate patriots but this is a this is how nice he is this is why you know if you have discernment you wouldn't be watching fake news and you would be watching something along the lines of hannity because the eyes are the windows of the soul 
and Cuomo looks like a nut job, just like the rest of them. But Hannity, you could tell, he appears to be a very genuine person. There we go again. Look, boom, boom, boom. All right, I'm out. I'm done. I don't know why this keeps doing that, but I'm done. At any rate, shakalaka from Noonan. I'm out. Yeah, I'm done for a while. That's my R RFB voice. You know, I'm getting tired of hearing about the stupid, this is Epstein, all this other nonsense. It just gets, a lot of stuff gets old. You know, you know what I'm, you know what I'm saying? See what I'm saying? It does. It gets old. And I can't, I can't focus, I can't sit down and make videos all day. I don't know how people do it. I, I really don't. They like churn them out like, uh, like it's nothing, like it's a factory. <laughs> I have other things. I actually try to live life and do things. So, and I have certain uh, areas of my life that I have to focus on. So, for now, I'm going to take a break. A summer vacation. Who knows how long? I don't know. Because at this point, I don't even think it cares anymore. It matters anymore. Right? Nobody cares. Who cares? Who cares about chemtrails? Who cares about 5G? Who cares? Right? That's what the masses say. And with the shadow banning and with the, uh, that's not an ethnic slur, you jackass. I'm an Italian. I wouldn't, a WAP is, you moron. Not Fredo. It's not ethnic slur, it's an idiot. Fredo's a name and a character of in some movie, what, The Godfather, and he's a moron and a loser? That suits you. That's not an ethnic slur. But see how they always gotta pull race into everything on that side? Sick bastards. I would never come and defend this piece of you know what. Anyway, I'm done for now. It's uh, it's no point. Everything falls upon deaf ears between the shadow banning and the sheeple are so far gone. That, you know, I don't have to say uh, you got a lot of mental illness out there, and you can't wake up or, or talk to mentally uh, affected people that are uh, showing signs of Alzheimer's and dementia from the chemtrails. That they think 5G is okay, they think vaccines okay, they think chemtrails are okay, and they think we are the crazy people. It's 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 absolutely upside down. That's it. Until next time, if there ever is, you've received the shock treatment.